was knocking at the door. He then entered my room. He then pulls the sheet, climbs over me. He pulls me in, says, embrace me. Let me embrace you. He was fondling my penis. He was caressing it, caressing my body. And it was just making me feel incredibly uncomfortable. Ladies and gentlemen, this is a wealthy businessman in a pickle. It's a critical and sensitive situation for him. It's a rare case, ladies and gentlemen, that you have the criminals on tape acknowledging their criminality, the very offence they are committing. And who is at home but paying for the bills, hoping that the matter gets dissolved resolved, closed, sorted for him, his case prevented so he doesn't have to go through with it. The man that this is all about, the reason the criminal enterprise existed, the man who indecently assaulted Mr. You have every reason to question the partial and incomplete evidence presented by the Crown and the absence of any police investigation here. You've got every reason to feel cold about the Crown case against my client. And really, the thought of it, I suggest to you, should leave you with real discomfort. There are many, many reasons to question the evidence that Mr gave to you, and there are very few indeed to accept it. And in the police excitement to sheet home responsibility for the attempt to pervert the course of justice, they took what Mr. said hook, line and sinker.